Hey there guys, this is Obsidian Chill. Got another video for today. And this video is going to touch on what's been kind of surrounding the game for the past, uh, possibly, was it three weeks now? Maybe a month? Maybe less than that? Can't remember exactly how long it's been, but uh, it's kind of been the elephant in the room for a lot of conversations on the forums or in game, and that's the what's happening with the economy in DC. Specifically on the USPS server. Uh, this is where it originated, and this is where it kind of like really went to shit. Uh, I'm sure you've seen videos uh, from other YouTubers, you've seen videos from the forums, trade chat. Uh, obviously, you know something was crazy out of whack in terms of uh, how much money and how much um, influxed and people refer to as inflation. That's, there's there's been a whole lot of misconceptions, false truths, false information spread. Uh, I'm not going to be touching on exact specifics here in this video, uh, but I do know everything going on. I don't want to touch on specifics because A, I don't know if the glitches have been fixed yet. Um, I know that there are steps in place, which is why people logging in, I mean, <laughs> for one thing, there's been kind of like a mass ban wave for 14 days for exploiting. Um, touching on that, there are some false flags with that. I will put in the comment section regarding how to submit a ticket. Uh, you may have to make another account or another email to submit that ticket, but if you do believe your ban was in error, submit that ticket to maps and then uh, talk to him there. But essentially the steps that were taken just the other day, if we go to the broker, pay, uh, pay attention to the left hand chat there. It's gonna say internal broker error. So they have taken and disabled the entire broker on every server. Uh, I believe so. I, I mean, I can't confirm uh, the Switch or the Xbox servers. I know it was taken down EU PS and USPS. Uh, so tr and also trading it's disabled. So you cannot trade cash with any players. Uh, both those features have been completely disabled and that is because of the glitches that were going on. So in terms of the glitches, there was three of them. Uh, one, uh, the first one was relating to a time capsule glitch. Uh, that one, it allowed you to basically, um, when the game shut down the servers, you could basically uh, do a process that would allow you to open a bunch of time capsules and then mail yourself if you got any good items. Uh, so that was uh, similar to the Link Dead glitch that happened at last Christmas, just on a smaller scale. The second glitch uh, revolved around the broker and around duplicating uh, the uh, broker items. That one wasn't as common because it was uh, much harder to reproduce. And then the third glitch, the third glitch is the one that's completely destroyed the economy on the USP server, and that is a cash glitch involving trade. So this one, it was a completely a duplication glitch. Uh, essentially, you could spend a half an hour, an hour to yourself and create like $100 billion, like just create money. So that's the thing. This, that had nothing to do with inflation. So all the people in the forums that you saw talking about inflation, you know, this is just natural. No, it was 100% because money was being duplicated on infinite in the game. So you had a massive influx of trillions and trillions of dollars into the DC economy that you, you can't support that. That's why, you know, before this uh, launched or before the, the broker went down, you had pages and pages and pages of everything being 999, 999, 999 for like a billion dollars. That's why all the neon mats have gone from like 1.5 billion to like 10 billion each. Uh, that's why everything is just being, you know, completely destroyed in terms of that. And this is the devs taking the first step necessary to correct that. Now, my, uh, I'd imagine the broker would be down for, what is it, 72 hours for everything to drop off. It's just easier for them to disable the broker, have all the items drop off, and then being sent back, rather than individually wiping everything on the broker. Uh, that's my guess there. That's why the broker has been disabled. And also to prevent that uh, that second glitch. And then the trading has, is going to probably just be stayed down until they can fix that glitch, or until steps can be implemented. So that's why. So it, it was nece completely necessary for it to happen. Uh, the bands are also necessary as well. I'm sh the, not to the level of the false bands um, that I can't entirely speak to. I'm, sh I'm sure because you can't get banned for um, doing actually like not actually doing the exploit. If you're taking advantage of the economy, then yeah, that's screwed up. But that's not a bannable offense. It's just, they just wipe cash. Uh, we don't know if a cash wipe is going to happen. It should happen. Uh, if it was me doing it, I would wipe everyone to like a hundred million dollars and have everyone you know start over fresh. But uh, that's that's what's been going on. So all the prices, like people selling stuff for like 50, 30 billion, all the cash, like the PS uh, server, like uh, raid resets going crazy high. PC resets were like 30 to 50 million just for one. That was 100% because of there was money duplication. So it had nothing to do with inflation. It was because money was being created. 
Uh, and it all started on the villain side on the USPS. It started out with a very small group of people. I'm talking like five or six people that knew the exploit. And then as time went on, other people kind of got it. They showed other people. I think at the end, it maybe have gone to about 15 different people. Uh, that's why it wasn't really on the EU server. Uh, this is it, it, The glitch works perfectly fine on Xbox, Switch, EU servers. It's just that the glitch never made it there because those people weren't doing it. It wasn't like the Link Dead glitch where everyone was getting free res resets. Everyone was doing the stabilization course glitch. It wasn't like that where you, know, you had full, like 400, 500 people banned. You know, it wasn't like that because this glitch wasn't on mass, you know, which is scary because the the type of cash that coming into the game and all the all trade chat showing shouting everything for a billion, all the people buying all this, you know, that was because like five or six people were doing this glitch. Uh, start on the villain side, um, and I can you know name drop that with Germ, Unholy Shadows. That was I don't really care about the, the people who kind of created it, but you know the thing is. That's how much of effect, like everything that you see that happened in this game in terms of money, in terms of the broker, in terms of uh, suspensions, all that, all of that happened because like five or six people, you know, that's, that's the effect that those five or six people had. So if these, if this glitch ever got out on mass, like if everyone started doing it, you know, you'd, you'd be ridiculous. <laughs> it would, the economy would be way worse than even it was. Cause it's just the glitch itself is incredibly easy to do. Like you have to, you have to, uh, you have to be doing something wrong not to get it correctly. Uh, so it's something that could easily, easily be replicated by any player. Uh, I will say you have to, in, in terms of the glitch, uh, you have to have, um, well, I guess you don't have to be a PS player, but you have to have a PS hardware. So if you're only a PC player, you can't do this. You would have to have a PC and PS hardware. Um, that's in, in terms of the glitch. So, like, I'm not trying to get into specifics. If people want to get into specifics in the comment section, they can. Like, uh, now there's now that it's being uh, the broker's being disabled. Now the trade's being disabled. Some people are trying to um, probably talk about it a bit more. But I'm not trying to get into specifics because I don't know how it's going to be patched in the end. Just that this is what's happening. So all the people in the forums that weren't sure what's going on or being told it was inflation or what there wasn't a glitch. You know, there was. There's three of them. And all the people that were false banned, I suggest you just submit a ticket. I'll put that link in the comment section. And I hope that there is a cash reset coming. You know, everything that I talked about and everything that uh, I would mention or if I was giving feedback, 100% there should be a cash wipe. In terms of what amount it should be cash wiped to, that's debatable. If it's like, you know, 100,000, you know, 100 million, uh, that's, it's all debatable. But uh, 100% that cash wipe needs to happen. In terms of items being destroyed, to people's inventory being taken, that I can't really speak to. That I mean, I don't see the point in that. That's unnecessary because if cash was wiped, like if they disabled trading in the mail, then that eliminates all the third-party cash websites. If you cannot trade cash in the mail, that completely destroys all those cash websites. If you hard cap the broker uh, trade window, like broker window and trade window, so you can pull and put like, you know, if they wipe everything to 100 million and they max the broker at a billion, then you know, that's another way to implement those steps. I don't know what direction the developers are going to take for that. Uh, those are just my points and my suggestions. But, you know, we know that if they, because this glitch was around as well, all the cash websites have huge stores. Like all the cash reps are selling like, you know, EG Pell is selling like, you know, 50 billion at a time. You know, MOOC is selling like 50 billion at a time. So all those websites have a huge inventory now that have to be taken care of. And the only way to do that if you don't catch the accounts is to cash wipe them. You know, any tunes that were deleted, uh, that are in escrow, those have to be wiped as well. So just so they can't recover a deleted tune and, and have the money, any kind of money that's being stored in the mail has to be deleted or just disable money being traded to mailing, you know, hard cap the broker window, hard cap the trade window, cash reset everyone. And then we all start out at a loving playing field. So if that's going to happen, who knows? But this is what's happened now. We have a mass wave of 14 day bans to a lot of people that were impacted by this. And brokers traded, brokers disabled, and trading disabled is on, at least on the US and EU servers. And we'll see how this all turns out. And then we'll see, catch you guys at the DLC as well. Thank you. Have a good day.